What's up? Shout out to my Trillizards. I'm Pow Polarized. You can call me Pow and welcome to this video. So, you're like, Pow, what the heck is this, man? Doing gameplay videos again? Yeah, forget about it. This channel is just gonna be whatever, so deal with it. This is a game called Made of Skur. This is from Wales Interactive. It's a, I think, pretty new horror game. Uh, so I'm excited to jump into it. Uh, expect more videos on this channel, just don't expect them to be any specific thing. Uh, this channel is just gonna be a fun little hobby spot, but that's not what this video is about. We're playing Made of Skur on normal difficulty. Uh, I am playing with a PS4 controller with a Sonic Forces sticker on it, because it is my favorite game, and Shemp, you can just leave, okay? Shemp, listen. You're a loser, Dearest okay. Thomas. Dearest Thomas. These Love you, Shemp. Words I wish to write. My father has learned of our plans, my love. Yet there is more, far worse, that I wish you to understand, but I fear you may believe me taken with madness. My father seeks to use me. As I have come to believe he used Things are not mother. great for Thomas here. He wishes me to sing for him as she did. To become the star attraction that will draw good folk to this accursed spit of land. My refusal to do so has led to my confinement here at Scare Hotel. This is so relatable. I'm just like, this, I've been here, you know? I feel this I moment. You to compose a melody for me. A counter to the song contained within this locket of my mother's. I realize this request will seem strange. That your first thought will be to come straight here. But without your composition, all hope of holding back the darkness gathering here will be lost. Oh, I'm... Am I Thomas? Always. And Elizabeth wrote to Elizabeth. me? Is that what's happening here? Yeah, that's what ha that's what's happening here. I am Thomas. I thought maybe we were writing to Thomas. Uh, turns out we're not Elizabeth. We're Thomas. I don't know. I know nothing about this. Leisha bought this for me yesterday. Super nice of her. Thank you, Alicia. Um, also, sorry if I, uh, if the audio, if I keep moving around too much. Uh, I'm too fidgety for an awesome dynamic microphone such as this. Uh, I'm gonna hit you with that jump scare. Text on the screen. Just calm down, I can't handle that. Not at this early in the morning. Sheesh. All right. We use phonographs to save our game. Typical. I have a, a phonograph over in the, the kitchen, and then I have one in the bathroom in case I die in there. Uh, it just respawns me, right? Okay, so we are using the controller. Oh, music sheet, okay. So, not great with sheet music. Uh, as a pathetic guitarist, I play tabs a lot, so. Not huge into sheet music, I, I'm Reading into it, though. Okay, that sensitivity is a smidge high. So let's just go and change that. Uh, I guess so it, it separates the two sensitivities. We'll do this to 20 and then this to 20, I guess. I don't know. I have no idea. Apply. And back. That's that's quite a bit better. Horror game. I don't know. It's I don't need uh, Twitch shooter... Uh, sensitivity. <laughs> okay. Honestly, right out the gate, very pretty looking game. Okay, inventories. Why? Okay. Uh, I don't see why I would... Okay, so we can just look at stuff. Um, neat, I guess. That's awesome. Super good. Okay, there's a sprint. Didn't even need the game to tell me during a tense portion of the game that there's a sprint function. Hmm. Hmm. This. I remember this train station being a little bit busier. I don't know why we send the whole train all the way out here, make a stop so this one guy can get off kinda by the Irish Sea. Like, I don't. What a useless train. Uh, is there a conductor in there? Oh, this is the end of the train, so he'd be way up there. That's lame. I can't even go meet the conductor. Well, yeah, I know how to run. 
<laughs> you wouldn't believe it if you met me in person, but I do know how to run. <laughs> um, okay. Well, this isn't honestly that bad. We got these nice trees. The bloom on the dynamic lighting there is just awesome. Uh, it's got my dog fidgeting in his seat. Oh, and apparently we're supposed to beware of you. Isn't that crazy? That is so funny. Oh, creepy music, I guess. Uh, I, I mean, I will beware of the dog if you just, like, I don't know, like, let me through. I didn't see any other way to go. Was there another way? Oh, yeah, there is. I'm super observant is something you'll notice about me is I'm very observant and I notice everything in my surrounding area. All right. Hey, save point. We can save here. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Just like in the bathroom. And it was in no small part due to my newfound fame and fortune that we were able to open Scare Hotel. Scare? It's pronounced Scare? Are you kidding me? Scare Hotel? When's Adam Sandler's Dracula gonna pop up? I said skr earlier, I think. Skirt, skirt. So here's more music. Yeah, okay, I can just turn that off. <laughs> I don't know why I did. Uh, so I'm guessing there's some kind of code here. I'm supposed to play the piano. There's only five notes on this, uh, like, four-octave piano. It's really great. Um, horror games, you know, it's all about just listening to people read things and reading things. It's really enthralling uh, and relatable. You know, that was always the thing for me is like, there's supposed to be like these immersive experiences. You're supposed to believe in this world in order for it to scare you. But I've never met anyone who leaves notes around the house. That takes me out of the immersion. I've never met anyone who does that, and even if I were haunted, I certainly wouldn't do that. I'd probably, like, like, do other things to try to prevent the, the ghosts and stuff. Oh, there's the dog we're supposed to be aware of. Oh, and I didn't even mention the mystical light. I, I play video games, I'm used to it, right? Oh. I'm supposed to be aware of you. Alright. Moving on, I suppose. My guy's got a bit of a vision like he's drunk. Just a little bit. Everything's just a bit hazy. Um, but like, I mean, you phone someone or you text somebody. Uh, maybe they'd find some Discord messages from me to my boys. Like, hey, yo, I'm gonna die. There's a demon here. But you wouldn't find letters in my house if I were haunted. Just simply wouldn't be the case. Oh, we're behind the gate now. Wow, really useful uh, gate there. You can just go around. But, uh, oh, and the bane of my existence, we're at another gate. So I guess, I guess this is where we're, we're going to end it. Because, like, gates seem to, yeah, stopped in my tracks. Who's singing over there? Nutcase. Alright. Okay, so... We can't... This would be a nice little picnic spot. Right here, in this little... Cove here. This is nice, right? You just sit down here. Do we have a crouch? We don't have crouch. But, you know, you can sit down here. Alright. What's this door? Oh, it's functioning... Up to spec! Opens like a dream. Dreams don't open. Kerchunk. It was a kerchunk. I love kerchunk sounds. Okay, that gate's open, but we haven't looked this way yet. 
No way. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> okay. We have the most physically inept person ever under our control here. He can't get past that. That is too much of an obstacle for him. I am immersed in this universe. I've never been able to step more than three feet off the ground. That would kill me, a fall from that height. Water's pretty murky. They should probably... Well, and, like, plants are growing all the way out of it. I don't know. Maybe they should hire a groundskeeper. They could also probably... Even if you just want to do gravel next time, you could probably get this filled. I mean, just anything for the convenience of your... 1897. Do we know what day it is? Do we have a day yet? Alright. Do we have a day? We don't have a day. What was that note? October 20th of 1897. That was written. And this is the 30th of the of 1987 that we're reopening. Okay. Okay. So that, that checks out. That checks out. The reopening hasn't happened yet. That's maybe, that's it. They're going to have a crew come in and repave the that uh, entryway. Probably pick up that log, too. People are having trouble getting past that one log that you have outside. So I'd probably clean that up that log really quick. Uh, wasn't super bewared by the dog. Though the dog was actually quite nice, he barked a couple times and was like, "Hey, come, come look! We got a cool gate over this way. All you gotta do is chunk it." Pretty good, pretty good dog. We gotta at least explore some of the hotel in this episode. Objective update. Okay. Um. Oh, this is a map. The objective is answer the phone. I ain't hear no phone. Sprint into danger. Let's do it. Be pretty ballsy of them to put something scary this early in the game. There's the phone. Kind of was expecting the phone because they told me to. It's Thomas, is that you, Elizabeth? Thomas! My Thomas! You do not know how wonderful it is to hear your voice. What happened here? I do not have the words or heart to voice it. It is far too terrible to recount. Please be careful, my love. This place is no longer safe. Then why am I not bouncing? Why am I here? If it ain't safe, then I'm bouncing. I'm out of here. I'm done. We're good. Because you just said it's too terrible to recount, and you sent your husband... In husband boyfriend and my boyfriend, what status am I with Elizabeth? Anyways, you sent me here to the death hotel, and something too terrible to recount happened. Okay, whatever. Your letter said, uh, I prayed that you received it, hoped that you would come. I know my request must have seemed strange, and I fear it was all for naught. That everything has changed now. Where are you? I'm safe upstairs, but I cannot leave the attic. I've had to lock and bar the door, hide away from the others. We've tracked the call, and it's coming from inside the house. Dun, dun, dun. My father and uncle, the staff. They have been beguiled by the darkness that inhabits this place. They are no longer themselves, mm. but stalk these halls, attacking anyone that makes a sound. Please, Thomas, listen carefully. Together we can put a stop to all of this. My father made recordings on brass cylinders of a song, a strange melody that affects the mind. If all of the cylinders are played together on the harmonium, this madness will end. Mm. You need to find them and bring them to me. Mm. Don't love that. Don't trust that super much because 
How do I know you're not beguiled by the darkness? And how do I know I won't be beguiled by the darkness at some point in time? It sounds like the beguiling of the darkness is pretty easy to happen. All they need to do is play the sound, I guess. Okay, this looks interactable. Okay, there's the crouch. Was not the button I was expecting it to be. Okay, I guess I can't. This looks so. Doesn't this just look so interactable? Okay. I'm not playing Deus Ex. I'm not playing. Uh, I played a game with a lot of events recently. Golden Eye Reloaded. Yo, can I get some dang service? Isaac's grand reopening note. I don't see, uh... I don't see move the log on there at all. Alright. What's that? Oh, I thought that was an interactable. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, classic me. Oh, another bell. Um, nothing to pick up on this desk. Oh, we could go around. No, we can't. Okay. Alrighty then. Hey, it's the guy from, um, Scooby-Doo. Oh, man, we're in for some real, real trouble here. Huh? Excuse me? You want to say that one more time? Okay, a door just opened, right? Where was that? Was that over here? Nah. Okay. I'm guessing the door opened from, like, a demon person. Right? One of those beguiled by the darkness is what I would... I would kind of guess. Oh, here's where they gotta play the Grand Harmonium, I guess. Like, there's four slots here. My guess is you play the Grand Harmonium or whatever she said. And then the beguiling goes away. Okay. So I'm guessing we're going to be doing a lot of stuff in this kind of main hub area throughout the game. This is like our warp room. Um, I guess we'll try this door. Boop. Works. Loving it. Alright. So we got a reception. And the toilets are both that way. Well, then what's this way? Are there no signs? Oh, here we go. Chapel. Okay, don't love any of that. Don't love the auto-closing doors, either. Not a huge fan of it. Um, ooh, uh, uh, a Savosphere. This is the Isaac Williams character. Huh? Oh. Okay, story. Is that filthy mongrel inside again? Father, she still pines is all. She misses... I'll give it a reason to pine. Come oh, I hate this you. dude already. Abraham? Abraham? Where is that useless Hate this brother? dude. Father, please. Straight up. Please, she just misses mother. Abraham? Abraham? I'll be rid of this dog once and for all. Yeah, you don't mess with dogs and be my friend. That's just simply the, the long and the short of it. All right. Is anyone there? Uh, who's there? Who are Yo, I'm you? Thomas. Henry. Henry Hughes. You must get me out. Your voice sounds Henry, a lot like the dog the guy. Open. Why'd they lock you in there? Why do you think? They're clearly rogues. They're trying to kidnap me. Please hurry. Do something. All right. I'll try to find a key. What? No. No, don't leave me. They might return any minute. Do oh, do something. I can't break it down from my side. Yeah, I was going to do something, you jerk. Okay, stand back. Good. Good. Try again. Harder, man! Throw yourself into it! Wait. Coming. They're coming. Alright, I'm out of here. Oh god, please, no! No, don't do this! You're doomed, dude. The 
Did they kill him? Yo, he a goner? Okay. I think he died, was what happened. And uh, hail the conquering hero, I sprinted back to the main lobby area so that I, too, would not die. Alright, so it's going to be one of these types of games where I can't see anything, and there's apparently a key somewhere. Alright. Let's try this room. Also locked. Super good. Loving the locked doors. This one's not locked. Oh, it's the turlets. All right, get your jump scare out of the way. No? Really? Hard to believe. Okay. I mean, usually you just expect horror game toilets to go bad. All right. Oh, we're in the um this area now from earlier. But we're behind the door. See, these should be interactable. Oh, it's making like a noise. Oh. Oh, I don't want to do that. That could get me in big old trouble. I don't want to do that. I want to be go able to go through the vents is what I want. Okay, here's the thing I can open. All right. Oh, is this like a map? Look for cylinders around the hotel and investigate the hotel. You mean for cylinders or what? Uh... Okay. Neato beans. I got a map or something. Um. Okay. Non interactable light switch. I guess we'll go to the chapel. Um. Next time on Made of Skur. Scares. Made of. Made of this place, this awesome hotel, uh, which I for sure will be staying at uh, because it seems really well kept and they treat the staff nice. Um, you know, uh, it seems like they really treat the guests like family and they treat their family really poorly. So you got to respect that from a small business just trying to make its way in the middle of Ireland. Or in the Irish Sea. I imagine we're in Ireland. But no one's really speaking thick Irish. I mean, maybe I'm being incredibly culturally insensitive. But thank you guys for watching. And I hope you enjoyed the video. See ya.